this is Daniel from uh, Silver Box again and we are here to show you now how to properly mix uh, your two tea oil uh, for two tea engines and uh, two stroke oil we call it two tea because we, we are talking here from Brazil and here uh, it's nickname it's like that but anyway we have two problems that can happen and we're going to approach them and I hope that it uh, can save you from some future trouble with your machine or a lawnmower or either a brush cutter or trimmers, stuff like that, a chainsaw. Anyway, uh, here we have the mixer. Uh, it's like a canister. It comes with uh, machines and uh, we have to respect these uh, canisters. You cannot use from one from the other, you know, from one machine to the other unless you really really check the proportions that come in the label uh, problem that can happen some machines have indications different than the others and the oils have specifications different than the others I, we have seen that the steel factory uh, they, they indicate a ratio of 1 to 20 uh, when the Chinese factories and the Chinese machines require 1 to 25 and we recommend you to use 1 to 30 in the beginning of the, the lifespan of the, of the engine. Uh, here in Brazil we have this uh, two-stroke uh, oil and uh, people insist in trying to use the still uh, oil that they sell in the authorized shops. They, you know, people trying to protect their engines, they might just be doing the worst thing that they could ever do because that oil is not proper, is not correct for the other engines like uh, the Chinese uh, and the German like the Makitas and stuff like that so you can be putting a different an incorrect ratio of oil in your machine therefore you, you can lead uh, for metal failure and overheating and stuff like that we have had cases like that here in the shop, uh, especially people that put th this oil in the ratio that they recommend in steel, and that is uh, a little less than the Chinese. Uh, I, sometimes I even think if they don't do that on purpose in order to, um, you know, induce or melt the, the engines of the other brands or of the Chinese people. I don't know. Anyway, so here we have uh, how to properly do it. You will fill the canister until almost the top. So uh, here we have painted uh, the, the letters here so we can see in the numbers uh, better in the video. Uh, but normally that doesn't come like that. It will come just like transparent like the rest of the canister. Uh, so we recommend that you really pay attention to this. When you say 1 to 25 guys, it's not 1 percent or 25 percent the per, it's not a percentage okay it's not one to 25 it's one part to 25 par, parts it's not 25 percent so some people memorize that number and they have never done it and then they are there in the woods and they then just you know make a ratio like a percentage of 25 percent so 25 percent would be three to one okay three to one is 25 percent here is 25 to 1. I don't even know the percentage that will be. It's extremely uh, difficult to calculate. Here we have 576.92 uh, ml, so to 600 ml. Uh, that's not something you should uh, calculate. Always use the canister. Now, we have another way to do this. 1 to 25. Come on, come on. Let's do it. If you want to do... You're, you don't have this and you want to do it, you're in the woods, you're wherever you are, and you want to do 1 to 25. Okay, so you have something like this. Can I use this? Yes. You put, then you're going to count, okay? You count 1, 2, 3, 4, until you get to 25, then you put 1 of oil. So that's the only way you can uh, surely make this ratio work without risking the lifespan of your engine okay so you can use whatever size stuff you want you can you can have this like this like this cap here and you fill it 25 times 
and then you fill it once with oil. If you have a little patience, you can do that. Uh, either than that, I don't think it would, I would recommend you to do anything different. You could lose your engine. And do not use, uh, you know, oils from specific brands. If you have the, that specific brand machine, if you have a steel machine, so they have the oil, okay, use that oil. But if you have a standard machine, a Chinese machine, use the oil that you can find anywhere you know in the supermarket in the gas stations whatever don't use the proper oil for a brand use it for like a generic thing use a oil for any uh, two-stroke engine and here you can also uh, in the beginning of the lifespan of the engine and then when you start using it use it first of all uh, you know take it easy on it on the first hours of use and also, uh, when you mix, put a little more, guys, you know, like the Brazilian people say, uh, give it a little cry when you're, you know, you're mixing. So here we are mixing. When you mix it, and you cry a little bit at the end. Okay? So I hope you enjoyed the video. Uh, and remember, that's the only part that we're going to put here in oil. You're not going to put any more it's just that little bit there hope you enjoyed the video if you did please uh, give a thumbs up there and uh, help us continue doing this and helping people around thank you